Season 1, Episode 5. Whoa. Uh-huh. Yeah, are you just the king of everything? There are no customers. <laughs> is it a holiday? <laughs> oh, nice. True. That's fair. <laughs> Fair enough. Stop it, stop it. <laughs> do anything to stop this. Nice. Clever. Was I even alive? Oh, this is cool. I like this. Those are the main nine covens, but there are hundreds of other ones you can join. There's flower coven, artist coven, big dog coven, small cat coven, tiniest cat coven. <laughs> <laughs> That's a, what hex mix. That dude is not a witch. They use power buttons to increase their strength. Oh, cool. Yeah, I guess glyphs would be the correct term, not runes. I've been I was calling them runes in the last episode. They're glyphs. Huh. Oh, sick. <laughs> Fortune teller. I'm not paying for Okay, that's a little bit more ominous. I accept your offering. The king of demons is back. All right, king. That panel looks popular. It's the emperor's coven. You think they'll sell my forehead? Only actually their fits are pretty cool. I mean, she has her own free will. She's over there. I think that's her. Oh. Mouse, wait up. All right, let's see this mess. Wait, that's actually really cool. Great one. Oh, I'm cackling right now. <laughs> the ex exhalation coming through my nose right now. Astounding. Oh, 
how much do you want to bet this Lilith person is who she went to uh, school with, like almost joined a coven with? I guarantee you that's who the other, that's who the we is. A hundred percent. It's like determining what house in Harry Potter you belong to. I mean, she probably physically can't be a witch, but she can still learn magic with her glyphs. So, I'm just saying she could stack up to Amity. Literally, what? What is Luce gonna do? That was a bad call. That's it. And two. Oh, okay. Admit that humans can be witches too. Fine by me. But when I win, not only do you have to tell the whole convention you're not a witch, you have to stop training them forever. Do it, Luce! Ooh. For my honor! Fine. Let's shake on it. Ooh. Magically binding. An hour? That was such a stupid decision. Yeah, you're cooked, man. Her sister? I guess they do look similar. Are we just using loose for everything in this episode? Like she's literally being used as a tool, man. I need your help. I accidentally challenged Amity to a duel and I think she's going to kill me all the way dead. It seems your student has been my strongest protege. And look at those Amity? Really? Where did you even find one of these? Okay, Edelin. Edelin's her full name. Oh, nice. Sick. Okay, okay, okay. So Luce challenge Amity. But also, Ida's going to help her train because Ida wants to prove to Lily that she can actually have a successful student. We're about to get some vigorous training, aren't we? Come on, kid. Time to prepare for bloodshed. Let's go. Who's what? Anyone's guess? <laughs> You haven't taught her anything. Yeah. Boy, I hope you didn't make an everlasting oath to stop learning magic or anything. You'd be toast. <laughs> Is there a good mm -hmm. hand thing that happens or uh, abomination? Rot. Oh man, you're so done for. <laughs> She's gonna have to cheat or something. Let's go.
trust me. And I will know in my heart. Even if I win now, I lose. Who cares? <laughs> I mean, I... Uh, sure. But who cares? That's the spirit. <laughs> Cheat your way to win. Who cares? You gotta like throw your hands up to pretend you did something. How did you do that? I uh Magic. Things that are free. People are giving offerings to me. Swag coven. Honestly so relatable. Like when you go to conventions and stuff, they always hand out a bunch of free stuff. Take advantage of that, man. You can get free clothes, pins, wristband sticker, food. I mean like Nah, he knows what he's doing. Nice. I saw you that time. Didn't use your hands. What are you getting at? Not dying. She doesn't need to use her hands. <laughs> I was about to say, how is he not dead? That would have killed her. Mikes? Well, now all is revealed. You were cheating. Amity, no. Oh, you took a fine tooth with me, but I still beat you. You lose. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. She was cheating too. A power clip from the construction coven. They both cheated. Uh-huh. <laughs> Beat it? I don't know. This is really funny. I mean, I guess... I mean, neither of them really won because they both cheated. But I guess that means the oath is useless now. Like a child! You were defeated. Don't get hated. Get <laughs> face treated. I'm one worth it. I oh, are they going to fight each other? Ooh, now this fight I want to see. There she is. I want to see what Edith can do. <laughs> cool. Sick. Yo, if they end up being friends, that would actually be really cool. They have a lot more in common than they think, or at least than Amity thinks. Cool. Ooh. Sick. Dude, they're actually like both really powerful. This is awesome. Sister. 
Oh. I was surprised when I first saw you today. I just Oh, like the elixir helps keep the curse at bay. But I'm guessing it's getting progressively worse and it's eventually going to overtake her because that's really sad if that's true. <laughs> That's nothing. A child can do a light spell. I've never seen anyone cast like that. It yeah, come drawn. Like it does for you. So I've had to improvise. <sighs> yeah, she can't like naturally make magic, but she has she can use tools to create magic. Oh, they'll be friends at some point. <laughs> well, who's left me? Let's just say she had a real snack attack. <laughs> uh -huh. She threw it at her like pocket sand. Uh, probably not. <laughs> Sister? No, that's a mysterious past payoff. Oh, you think that's all the mystery I got? Wait till you hear about my parents. What? Oh? You got parents? I need to know more. You very much don't. We we'll, we'll learn in due time. <laughs> We got a villain in the making. Let's go. Very solid episode as well. We got some more dump. We got backstory on Ida. Ida has a sister. Her name is Lily. They had an interesting upbringing. And even though Lily still loves Ida, and Ida kind of loves Lily a little bit, uh, I guess Lily has been tasked with bringing her in. Makes sense. Ida's kind of a, a problem. Also, she's wanted right now. Um... But yeah, also interesting that Ida brought up the whole, her curse. So it seems like she's treating her curse, but she's not curing it. She can't cure it. So she can treat her curse by the elixir, but there she can't cure it by any means. And it seems like it's progressive and therefore will eventually overtake her unless the curse is broken. That bound, bound curse is broken. But I guess to do that, we need to first find out who cursed her, which Ida doesn't even know. So, who knows? But I thought that was interesting to bring up. But also, their fight together was so cool. They were both super powerful witches, and watching them duel was sick. As for the rest of the episode, awesome. Seeing Luz stand up to MD and being like, I challenge you, even though that was a stupid idea. But I guess it worked out in the end, um, because they both ended up cheating. <laughs> uh, but, you know, just her standing up to that was nice, and... You know, Amity still hates her or hated her, but she has a little bit of respect for her. She's still not very fond of her, but I'm sure in due time they'll be great friends. You know, it's it's shaping up to be that way. Um, but yeah, this whole convention thing was just fun. You know, King getting all the like merch and stuff. Like, totally respect that. I do that when I go to conventions. Um, yeah, just very solid episode all around. I really like this. There's a lot of magic involved, a lot of more lore dump, you know, very well written characters, returning characters, a fun, you know, idea with the whole coven convention, you know, like how joining a coven can prevent you from using different types of magic, but being free, you can use any type of magic. Like, it was just fun seeing all the intricacies on how this world works, especially the covens and the witches and stuff like that. But yeah, this was a very solid episode. We got a lot of character development, I think, especially out of Amity and Luce. We got more story for Ida and her sister Lily now. And King was just kind of there vibing, which honestly I respect. So yeah, very solid entry in this show. I really liked it.
I think this is probably the most interesting episode we've had so far. I actually think I like this one the most. Very solid. So, yeah. Anyways, um, I'll see you guys in the next one.